grade 5 science and technology computing devices today we shall learn about coding and programming codes are the steps the computer follows to solve a problem the process of creating the codes is called coding or programming Coding or programming is done by computer programmers. They write the codes to solve everyday problems. Codes are instructions given to the computer to solve a given problem. Now, there is an application called the Scratch app the scratch application the scratch app can be used to create animations animations are removing images the app can be downloaded from the internet scratch is a computer programming language it allows you to code simple programs. In Scratch, sprites are images and the scripts are instructions. Block palettes are used to control sprites. Now let us look at the features of the, the Scratch window. That is the Scratch window. Now, in these parts of the window, that is the block palette. Those are the blocks. And what you do, you select your block from here and you drag it and place it here. So we drag the blocks and place them here. Now here, there is this flag. When you press the green flag, then you are able to run your, your game because you want to play a game. So you drag your blocks from here to this place. You also use a sprite. This is a sprite. This is an example of a sprite that image. So you choose price from here. When you click here, you'll be able to select a sprite that you want. It may be an, an animal, it may be some other object, you shall look at that. So you select your sprite from here, it comes there, and then you drag your blocks from here in this place. Because the blocks are the instructions that we give to the computer to be able to play our game. Now these buttons here are for zooming if you want your window to, be, to become bigger or smaller. And these other icons, this when you want to add a sprite. And here when you want to add a backdrop or let's say the, the background if your sprite here is a ball then you can add a football pitch so that you see how the ball plays in that football pitch background so now we are going to practice how to use the scratch window or rather how to use the scratch application so I can exit that then I can have my scratch application window so this is the scratch application and I want to play some game so the first thing I'll do is that I will choose a sprite to choose a sprite I said click here when you click there, you 
without those options. We want to choose a ball, we want to choose ballerina, we want to choose uh, or, uh, bananas, or whatever you want to choose. So in our case, let's try to choose the ball. Because boys like playing football. Choose that ball, now it appears there. That's where the sprite goes. After that, you want to give this ball instructions. You want to give the computer instruction and then we see how it is going to play the game. So we do that by selecting the blocks. This is where we have the instructions, the blocks. So I want that ball to move to move 10 steps. So I, I drag that block and put it there. I want that ball to turn 15 degrees on the, uh, uh, on, on the left. So I drag that one, the block and put it there and it has to fit. It has to fit into that one. Now after I've done that, those are the instructions. I want to make sure that uh, after that I run. I run the process. So I come here and choose that one. This one here is, is an instruction for me to run the, the game. So I put it there. Okay, so I have my blocks dragged from there to this space. These are the instructions. This is my script which I want to uh, to apply to this ball so that it is moves the way you want it to move. So we give this instruction to the computer and it's able to, to do what we want it to do. So now we go to run where the flag is here. So you click run and see what the, how the ball will behave. So when I click there, look at the ball, it moves. It moves. So if I if I do it repeatedly, you see it is moving and turning. Moving and turning. Okay? That ball. Now what do I do? I want to give it a background, maybe the football pitch. So I click there and then I have those backgrounds which will appear there. I'll choose one of them. I wanted to choose a football pitch, maybe that one. So you see, it will come there, it has come there, and this is our goal. Now, where is run? Where the flag is, the green flag is. So I click on that green flag to run the, the game. So you see now the ball is moving, but outside the pitch, right? It's going up, going down. That's how the ball is moving on that backdrop. So that's how you can use the Scratch application to play games. You can do so many things using the Scratch application. And then you can save even your, what you have done even share with the world. So that's how we use the Scratch application for the grade 5 learners.